Innovation Spotlight. Aerial Light and Iron Strong. Clariant Mining, Sustainable Exploration of Iron Ore. A modern world without steel is unimaginable. As the world population increases, the demand for steel increases. Steel is made of iron ore, but the world's accessible reserves could be exhausted within the next 60 years. The available iron ore is increasingly associated with undesirable minerals like silica, which makes it harder to process. Clariant has been developing specialized reagents that enhance the value of iron ore for over half a century. To extract iron ore from the other undesirable elements, the ore is first crushed mechanically in several steps until it is pulverized. Froth flotation is one of the processes which can then be used to remove impurities. In a froth flotation plant, a number of large flotation tanks called cells are used to process huge volumes of material. Each cell is continuously filled with a mixture of the untreated ore and water to form a feed slurry. A rotating impeller keeps it in suspension, the solids being finely dispersed in the liquid. Air is injected and forms bubbles which rise to the surface. The unwanted minerals collect on the surface of the bubbles as they rise. Normally, the impurities like silica would not stick to the bubbles. The chemicals of clariant help to form a bond between the silica particles and the surface of the bubbles. One end of these molecules is hydrophilic or so-called water-loving, hence attaches to the surface of silica particles while the other end is a hydrophobic or so-called water-hating compound that likes to get out of the water and into the airspace of the rising bubbles. These chemicals are called collectors because they collect minerals to the surface of bubbles. Once the silica is removed from the iron ore slurry, the solids are re-grinded and filtered out and the remaining water is reused and returned to the beginning of the cycle. The resulting humid iron ore material, called fines, now needs to be converted into pellets to facilitate transport and handling. With the help of Clarion's specific binding reagent Flotacore PA8000 and a rotating pelletizer, the iron ore fines are agglomerated into stable and pure iron ore pellets within as little as 45 seconds which is shorter and saves more energy compared to the standard processes. Traditionally, binders like bentonite, which is a silica containing natural clay, have been used for pelletizing. Now, using Clariant's Flotacore PA8000, the amount of bentonite can be reduced by 70%. Clarion's additive helps very small iron ore particles, called microfines, travel through the wet slurry and be distributed evenly throughout the pellet. This forces out water and increases pellet compaction. Thus, in comparison to conventional material, the treated pellets are more robust and less susceptible to cracking and breakage. Reduced water content means less heating in the pelletizing furnace during a final preparation step, where the pellets are roasted at high temperatures. After cooling down, the iron ore pellets are ready to be shipped. Ultimately, they reach the steel mill. By reducing the silica content and allowing for more iron, the pellets are more valuable. By minimizing losses during transportation and handling, Clariant helps to keep up with the requirements of modern life in a more sustainable and effective way. Clariant.